Hello and welcome back to the little mailbox. Here we are, yet again, with this terrible intro. And I really do mean it. I have to work on this. I'm actually pressing play on my keyboard and that's Nero over there. Wow. Just jumping up when he hears me starting a video because he's like, no. Daddy's gonna make a noise here now and I don't want any part of it. Little does he know, there's actually some Nero puppy fan art in here. I've checked. <laughs> Wait, this is a bit loud. There we go. Okay, so. This time around, we're looking at two packages, or envelopes, I suppose you could call them. Which one should we start with? Hmm. Hmm. Okay, we start with this one, the slightly smaller looking one. As you can see, our address is right on here. And if you're looking for our address, you can find it below. That's our PO Box address. And if you do send something there, it should arrive. After... <laughs> A sometimes pretty long period of time. I'm not sure when you guys sent these, but they arrived just a couple of days ago here. Safely, I must add. Quite safely. Now this one is full of random little letters, and I love it. I absolutely love it. I just need to figure out which one to read first, so bear with me for a second here. Bear with me. It might be this one. I think it's this one. No, no, it's not this one. It's this one. <laughs> it's so confusing. I confuse myself all the time. Really, I do. This is it. This is it. And... Oh, no, this is not it! No! 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 Oh, my goodness. Just edit this part out. Okay? Edit this part out. Because I'm bad. Really bad at doing this. Oh, this is it. Okay, this is the one. If I can get it open. Gah! Doing battle with paper. There we go. Okay. Dear Lumen, I absolutely love your videos. Seriously. You are truly, no joke, a god at work when it comes to gaming. <laughs> I hate to break this to you, but I'm terrible at games. I'm pretty bad. The commentary, you know, I'd do okay with that. But thank you. Thank you so, so much. It means the world to me. It really does. Oh yeah, I just remembered two Skyrim mods that you could try. One of them is Dragon Weapons. Now, I don't know if you could make Dragon Bone and Dragon Scale Weapons, but it looks so cool. The other mod is Scout Armor. It's totally awesome. That right there is enough. Say no more. Scout armor, totally awesome. Both those things would actually make me get this mod. And because you just mentioned these two, I'm going to talk about scout armor a little bit more in just a second because there's more written about it here. But I'm going to add these to Skyrim as soon as I possibly can. I saw the dragon weapons thing. I saw it on Steam. It was right there. I just thought to myself, well, I don't want to add too many mods. But seeing that I played so many episodes of Skyrim already, I think it's about time to mix things up a little. So I'm gonna add those two and see how they are. I really will. And I can't wait. It's totally awesome. You look like a scout. You can make a hood and a cape and they can be brown, green and white depending on if you're in the fields of Whiterun, forest or even in the northern reaches of Skyrim. You can even make uh, your own weapons appropriate to a scout. I actually have weapons appropriate to scout. My bow, perfect for that. Perfect. I'd be like Legolas. Except much cooler. Because he's not that cool. Anyway, okay, okay. Shh. So, uh, where was I? Pretty cool, right? Yes, incredibly cool. Check them out. I will. Sincerely, Chris. YouTube account is Wolfmaster327. Awesome stuff. Amazing nickname, once again. Then, P.S. Look in the envelope for a drawing of Nero. It's here. It's just behind you. We're going to have a look at that in just a second. Say hi. Oh, this is PSS. Say hi to Nero and Zohi for me. Well, we kind of said hi to Nero right there at the start. PSSS. Oh, yeah. Can you please keep making Minecraft, Skyrim, and Terraria, please? That's a lot of please for one sentence. I have just uploaded a Minecraft episode. Skyrim's already been recorded. It's going up soon. As for Terraria, uh, it's a little bit difficult doing Terraria right now because there's not much to do in it, but, but I will do you one better and probably make episodes of Starbound when that comes out. And that's very similar to Terraria. I'm sure you will enjoy it. I'm sure. Now, now let's look at the other stuff in here. Because there is other stuff in here. First, let's look at the Nero Puppy portrait. And listen, I had a look at this. And I have to say, it is one of the best pictures of Nero I've ever seen. Look at that. Oh my goodness. I will put, uh, like, 
photos of this at the end of the video so you can have a look at it all. It says here, okay, not my best drawing, but I tried. Chris. That says, sleeping Nero. Or Nero sleeping. Look at that, he's so cute. He's curled up really tightly, so it must be very cold. It's quite appropriate that you sent this envelope in winter. Because that's how he sleeps almost every day. I like it. Thank you very much. I'm going to show it to Nero. And soon. And to Eileen. I've actually shown it to Eileen already. And she loved it just as much as me. It's too cute. Too cute. Now, let's look at the next one. Lumen's bow. There you go. And I've got, it looks, it actually looks like I've got some bones in my quiver. The arrows look a little bit like bones, but they're still very cool. There's the bow. I'm not that good of an artist. Sue me. <laughs> not really. That was just a joke. Good one. I thought you were serious for a second there. Are you going to frame it at the bottom here in brackets? Now that I love. I'm not sure if I'm going to frame this one, but I'm seriously considering framing the one of Nero Puppy. Where is it now? This one. Oh, 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 you can't see it properly. There you go. There you go. That one. Man, I love it. Okay. I, I absolutely love it. I was, I think I said it before, I was going to, I was thinking of getting a very, very big frame, sort of the size of that, and putting a whole bunch of Nero Puppy art in there. And if I do, there's going to be one dedicated to Nero, then this one is going in there. Just like this. It's going in there. Fear not. Last one. This is the last piece in this envelope. Okay. Arrgh! I got it open. I have no idea why this is on a big piece of paper, or why the ink is black instead of blue. But what's your Minecraft skin called? It looks so stinking awesome. I just wanted to know um, if you can tell me. Chris. Sorry, I, I, I suck at reading. I really, really do. I'm bad at it. It's one of the things I'm worst at in this life. So, my Minecraft skin. <laughs> Good question. I don't think it has a name. It was actually sent to me by an anonymous person. Someone sent it to me with a random email address. I mailed them back and they never replied. Okay. But what I will do is I'll link the video that has it in below. And I think it was actually made with a pretty simple Minecraft skin creator. Not very difficult to make. Not very difficult to recreate. So I'll link you that video below. And you can check it out. All the skins that was that people sent me, that my uh, the subscribers, you guys, actually sent to me. I don't know if any of you remember it. It was a long time ago. Some of the names are still familiar. You can check the video out and you'll see some names that you probably know. But it was a long time ago. They sent them to me and we chose one. We had a panel of voters and we chose one. And the one that I have there is the one that won. So, check the video out. But now, oh, and again, thank you very much. Wolfmaster, Chris, thank you so much for the envelope full of goodies. I love it. I love it all. But here's the next one. This one's slightly fatter. And as with the previous one, I don't know why they all come here looking so road weary. So well traveled. I don't understand it, okay? But it must be something to do with the South African Postal Service. Like when they receive the mail, they just crush it. They put it through its paces. Because these ones have definitely been, as I always say, on grand adventures. Look at this. Even if the adventure isn't that grand and it just ends up being more people frumpling them around and stuff. It could be grand for an envelope. Quite sure of that. But this one has a few goodies in. Well, it's got a goodie in and a few more notes. Now first, let me show you this. No, no, no. First, first the letter. First the letter. Because it's quite good. Come on. Open. <laughs> I'm terrible at this. There we go. Hey, Lumen. I hope you liked my last package, as I loved your great comments. I really did. This is from Brandon, by the way. Tic-tac-toe, I see a cheeky. This is from him, yet again. And I did love the last package. I really, really did. I hope Nero loves the tile. Oh, he does. Trust me. This ninja I sent you has been on a grand adventure. Now, Brandon doesn't actually say what kind of adventure it was. Where the adventure took the ninja. Nothing like that. So we're going to let the ninja speak for itself. When I actually show it to you. The figure or Lego man I sent you is from the 2005... Uh, and Oh, it's from 2005 and the series is Lego Alpha Team. Sincerely, Brandon. Smiley face. Now. Firstly, thank you so much for identifying that little Lego man to me because I had no idea. Looked like a villain from Deus Ex. 
or a villainous version of me. Which is obviously really cool. It is an apt gift to send. <laughs> then, this one. And I really like this one as well. Okay. This isn't quite Nero Puppy, but you could call this, you could categorize it with Nero Puppy fan art. Because, you know, if you're not an artist, then you can do something like this. It says Lumen rocks forever, and there's a cute little puppy. Look at that. Wow. And it says Lumen for the win here. And funny enough, okay, I don't know if Brandon realized this, but he actually used colors here that seem to be from the former South African flag. You know, the one with the orange, blue, and white in. <laughs> so, unintentionally, he gave me the South African flag colors, or at least the former ones. So that's amazing, and look at that cute puppy. Look at that. That could just as well have been Nero when he was a puppy. It really could have, because he was that cute. But now, now, rah, 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 rah. <laughs> Look at me just getting it out. Ta-da! Look at that little guy. Wow! Look at him! Now, I actually have a game, an app on my phone called Trees of Doom. Okay, and it's this little ninja that jumps up um, trees. It's a little climbing game. I don't think I have it anymore, actually. I had it. And the ninjas in that look exactly like this little guy. He's super handsome. Look at his little black eyes. And there's his little ninja mask, the white part there. Well, it's not so white anymore because, as you can see, this guy has been on a grand adventure. Okay, he really has. There he is from behind. Quite blue and quite handsome. Ha <laughs> ha. If I do say so myself. As for the grand adventure that he's been on, I really can't say. He could have been anywhere. He could have been battling dragons, other ninja clans, samurais, to prove to them once and for all that ninjas are much cooler than samurais. <laughs> There's no contest. There really is no contest. But that is too cool. It really is too cool. So thank you very much once again, Brandon. And... To all the rest of you, if you do send stuff through, I'll have a look at it on video. And you can find the address below. Anything at all. Go ahead, go crazy. I must also mention that there's probably going to be another new mailbox coming up soon that's going to contain the online stuff. So like art and stuff. So if you want to send any art, be it fan art, be it just semi-related to Tales of Lumen, to any adventures that we've been on, perhaps in Guild Wars or any of the games that I play, anything at all, feel free to send it to talesoflumen at gmail.com and I'll throw it in that video. I obviously talk about it and stuff and it's a lot of fun. I really enjoy it so much. It's kind of like I'm <coughs> reviewing the art in a sense, but it's a lot more fun than that because reviews are generally quite serious and no one is serious on this channel. Okay? So check back here soon for that. And thank you again to Brandon, Tic-Tac-Toe, I see a cheeky. And Chris, what's his name? <laughs> I totally forgot now. Wolfmaster. I do remember Wolfmaster. Let's open it to make sure, because I would be so embarrassed if I didn't get it right. There we go. Oh, this is from Brandon again. <laughs> oh, Brandon, you're everywhere. You are actually everywhere. Now, how do I find it? There, this must be it. This must be it. Hold on, it is Chris. Man, I've got the best memory in the world. So, check back here soon for more. Hopefully very soon for more Lumail boxes. Most importantly though, happy receiving even more mail and some really cool goodies for Nero, like this portrait of him, and this adventurous ninja. I mean, look at him. His face. That's pure adventure right there. Happy all those things.